I've just returned from the uh, Bayshore St. Patrick's Parade. And what a beautiful day we had for it. Gorgeous day. Uh, the bands and uh, the music, the bagpipes, just beautiful. Out there for several hours in the warm, uh, warmer weather and sun shining. And seeing people I know and watching um, people I love march in the parade. Tonight we spring our clocks ahead one hour as we move to uh, daylight savings time. And uh, another su Saturday evening uh, that we have to prepare our hearts for the Word of God and worshiping Him tomorrow morning. This is a, uh, a special time, a Saturday evening. Time to wind down, uh, try to uh, uh, start to focus your hearts and minds on uh, tomorrow. And I just want to uh, uh, speak for a moment about something that often we, um, we don't think about when we are thinking about going to church, and that's the other people that are going to be there that need to be encouraged. They may need a hug or, or just someone to listen to. And our, our churches here on Long Island will be filled with such people tomorrow. And often, uh, you know, we're go, we go to church, I know I even do as the pastor, and saying, Lord, bless, the, bless me today, and, and give us a great blessing. And, and uh, many times the Lord, I think, is saying, you're the blessing that I want to give to someone else. Are you, uh, are you ready to be that blessing? So tomorrow, when you walk into church, look around. Look for the lonely, the downcast, the, those that are discouraged, those that may be going through financial uh, problems. Look for those uh, parents that are trying to raise uh, a number of children in their home these days. Um, and uh, the widows, those that are without uh, husbands. And go to them and encourage them. You'll find yourself encouraged by doing so. The uh, verse that I love to uh, quote, Hebrews 10.25 let us not give up meeting together as some are in the habit of doing. We do, as I said a few weeks ago, we really do need one another. We need to be in a fellowship uh, where we can connect with others and where others can connect with us. And then let us not give up meeting together as some are in the habit of doing, but let us encourage each other. Oh, I, what a great uh, promise there. Let's do that tomorrow. Let's encourage the the uh, the rest of the people that are around us. Encourage your pastor. Uh, you will just by being there, and then you can uh, tell him you're praying for him, and if you have been, do that. And if you haven't, pray for him now and tell him you prayed for him last night. Uh, and all the more, as we see that day approaching, one day Jesus will come back. He's promised that he would. And uh, what a great thing to be uh, uh, in tune with him. Uh, so God bless you this evening, and may you have a wonderful, wonderful Lord's Day tomorrow. God bless you.